I'm headed to explore a phenomenon that has been underway for decades. Hundreds of thousands of African-American men across the country have converted to Islam behind bars. First, if I could get a show of hands, how many of you all converted to Islam inside prison? So almost all of you. I believe that we find Islam in here because you have nothing but time and books. And once you study the truth, the truth. You know, we have the example of the prophet and I wanted to be a different man, just being a better father being a better husband. So our responsibility as Muslims, when we get out, we have to show them that Islam is not what they generally see in the media. These men want to share this message with the outside world, and one of them is about to get his chance. Tomorrow, after more than five years, 34-year-old Kevin is getting out early for good behavior. Once a week, they come together in prayer. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. For Kareem, one of the initial draws to the faith was that the Prophet Muhammad had companions who were the lowest members of society. His followers were outcasts. They were like us. Your brother Kareem is leaving here tomorrow. Does anyone have any words for him? Hopefully I will meet you again I, in the world. Forgive me, I'm getting emotional a little bit. You know, because we love our brothers. We do. We really do. We love our brothers. <laughs> I love you too, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> Kareem is clearly going to be missed. You know we love you. Uh, love you Tomorrow, he leaves behind this brotherhood and takes his fortified faith and knowledge out into the world.